all right, hitting all the right notes. Our next guest is someone we're really familiar to uh, jazz fans here in Detroit. Her latest album was released earlier this year, and uh, you can get it right now. And she's going to be performing live coming up. We're going to tell you where that is. But first, we're joined by Galen McKinney. Uh, thank you so much for joining us this morning. Really do appreciate it. Oh, thank you for having me. I appreciate you having me. Well, tell us a little bit about recording an album during the pandemic. How were you guys able to pull that off? Well, thankfully, <laughs> most of the of the CD had been recorded before the pandemic hit. And um, uh, so the last a little bit of it, you know, just had to be about fine tuning and, and um, um, mixing. So, you know, you just mask up. <laughs> yeah, okay. Mask up and try to stay six feet apart. <laughs> All right. Now tell us a little bit uh, about your style. You know, there's so many different kinds of jazz and so many influences. Tell us a little more about what listeners can expect when they hear the album. Well, I, I come from an interesting background. Um, my father, his name was Harold McKinney. Um, he was a prominent jazz musician in the city and, and helped... Uh, many, many jazz artists in the city become who they are, including me. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and so I had a lot of uh, Motown influence, bebop jazz, traditional jazz. But when I became a teenager, I got into fusion jazz, which is, you know, like Chickawee. We just lost Chick a little while ago. Mm -hmm. um, Return forever. And so I got into that. Of course, Parliament Funkadelic. <laughs> I yeah. got into that. But, um, this album is kind of a combination of, I would say, fusion, uh, traditional, uh, Motown. Uh, I've got some really good players on here, like uh, Trinita Womack, who was uh, the percussionist for the Funk Brothers. Uh, she played a lot behind a lot of the Motown artists. Mm -hmm. She's playing on here percussion. Wow. And um, uh, I have a wonderful uh, young bassist who was in the movie Sparkle named Ibrahim Jones. Mm -hmm. He's playing with me. Demetrius Neighbors, who is a fabulous um, pianist who just got a, I believe he just got a Grammy nomination for producing Tim Bowman's record. So I got some really nice players, Alex Annis and uh, the great, the wonderful young lion, Raphael Staten. Well, that is fantastic. fantastic. Let's listen to uh, a bit of the album. All right.
right. Fantastic. That is a way to start the morning. Galen McKinney, uh, thank you so much for joining us this morning. Tell us a little bit about where people can catch you this weekend. All right. This weekend, um, I will be at the Solstice Festival in Lansing, and um, that'll be at 730. And it'll also be streaming on the um, uh, Summer Solstice website if you can't get to the show, because I think there's limited, it's limited seating. So I Absolutely. think if you want to see it, you can see it uh, online as well. All right, and we can find your uh, uh, album. It's uh, Gayla McKinney and McKinney Zone's new album, Zoot Suit Funk. It's available on iTunes, Spotify, Amazon, and we can always find more information and keep up with you at GaylenMcKinney.com. Galen, thank you so much for joining us. We'll be right back.